Hey, what's up, guys? My name is Versatile. Welcome back to another Grand Theft Auto video. And today, we're checking out the new update that is on May uh, May twenty fifth. There is a new update for the Grand Theft Auto Seven, and this is our monthly update. So, we have no issues. We have update details. So, for them to say no issues right after an update, they probably broke broke something. But today, we're gonna go over the update details. So. We have three new cars, which is the Alfa Romeo, R32, and some of these I don't really, I don't really care for those cars. Not not, I buy the R32, but nothing I really care about too much. So we have new events: so Autopolis, we have Super Formula, High Speed Rings, American Club, and Club Seven Hundred. Blue Moon, Blue Moon Bay Speedway will be the Nissan GTR Cup. Road Atlanta will be Super Formula, and Monza will be Sunday Cup Classic. So in total for a month, we have one, two, three, four, five events. You can probably knock these things. You can knock them out in a day. Escapes Japan Stadium and Lake District. Extra Menu Twenty Three is the Sema GT Awards. S22, extra menu number 23 is the Group A. That's a race car category. Let's see what that is. Brand Central, new museum for Alfa Romeo and Auto Design. A player always a car in the same color and obviously split is owned. Okay. Used cars. Tuning algorithm and the car valuation service has been adjusted for cars with ultimate tuning parts fitted. Engine swap service has been added to the car mint. That's called level 50. Ultimate level 50. Free practice button has been added to each championship's entry screen. It's got possible to adjust controller settings. Okay. Multiplayer. New restrictions for engine swaps and tuna parts added. During qualifying time trials. Okay. So let's look at the issues are. So pretty much Logitech. That's a wheel. Control disconnected. Use the PS4 version PS5 console. Oh, okay. A lot of people playing the PS4 version of GT7 on the PS5. I don't know. Having all room members leave and re enter. Just like. Oh my god. Same room did not appear for the, on the member list or during race. Lobby there in cases where completing the race will now use uh, users progress further. I progressed enough in this game, so I don't even know what they're talking about. So I have a few things to get in. So let's check out the cafe. Because why not? What was this ticket? I don't know I don't even know what the prize was. That's a five star. I mean, I'm just gonna buy them and sell them again, like if I comp if I ever decide to complete them. Inline six power BMWs, Skyline GTRs, Bugatti, Honda race cars. Was this thing really a race car? I doubt it. So here we go. We have the Group A, which is the Skyline M3 and Sierra. Alpine Semi GT Awards. You can you can you can knock this out. Uh, Shelby. Wait, did they mess with the rewards? I think they probably messed with it because um I'm gonna have to buy those cars again to complete it. These are all the cars I bought. 271 out of 471. Need to get my money back up, really. But right now, I'm not, I don't have no interest in this game, really. And this doesn't look like it can bring me back. So what we have in here? Ooh, the Skyline's back. I actually want to buy this. I'm not gonna sell it this time, I swear.
Alright. Far from me at least. Okay. 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 Bruh. <laughs> <laughs> All right, just this. Makes it 1,232 horsepower. New body is 48,000. You do have the ultimate parts though. Oh my God. Now it's 1,232 horsepower. It's officially maxed out. How many engines do I have? With me? I don't know if few of these are compatible. I still have to only delete these. Does it work with every engine swap car though? I don't think the 787B has a ultra high RPM turbocharger. I'm gonna see. Okay, it doesn't. You have a stage five weight reduction. That is three hundred thousand dollars. Okay. okay. Now it's just back to being disappointed in casual mode. So this is what we're gonna do. What we are going to do. I want to test. What is that? Well, that's not coming to Grand Turismo anytime soon. So, we're going to use the C8 for this one. I'm trying to see if there's a few cars you can use that are. Um, hmm. Porsche. I want to use the 09 and the 16, but I think it might be better if we just use the 16 one. the next one we can use. I'm just trying to see if there's any one we can actually use. Okay, so the Honda, the NSX already has. Actually, the Civic has a touring car version. Let's see if we can use that. I'll buy the Civic. I'm just going to test these for different things. Because the Civic does have a touring car version. I want to see if we can put a race car engine into it. I have no idea why Sony AI is considered a, but it says brand central, not manufacturer, so. <sighs> All right. So we're gonna use the, we're gonna use the Porsche first, actually. The 911 GT3 RS. So car customization. No, not that yet, not that yet. Car maintenance and service. That is an M9780. Oh, okay. Okay. I'll definitely swap it. Okay. So the M9780, I think is the same engine as the, yeah, it's the nine, it's the uh, 911 GT3. Oh my God. <laughs> 
<laughs> what was that noise? So he actually got brave car engine in this thing now. So the next one be the C8. But first, let me see what let me see what engine the Corvette C7 has. So the V8 Corvette GT3. Okay. Let's see what this does. GT Auto. Car maintenance and service. Ah, uh, you can't engine swap it. I guess it's only with certain cars. <clears throat> the Civic. That cannot be engine swapped either. <clears throat> Alright, well, I'll find out eventually. If you guys did enjoy this little segment, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Um, I don't know what another good engine swap is either. That's going to be tricky. But yeah, I'll keep digging. I'll find some eventually. I know this can't be interest swap. All right. It was a nice try. But um, yeah, I'll keep digging. If you guys enjoyed this segment, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you the next one.